Also, there was some flooding outside of Medical University of South Carolina in Charleston, one of many areas seeing the wrath of Hurricane Dorian. You can see just flooding, turning roads into rivers. Nothing left out there. Yeah, you never know what's floating beneath the surface as well, which is why you have to heed the warnings. Do not go out in this by any means. Well, Hurricane Dorian making a big impact on more than just the coast. Yeah, as WXI's Kirsten Gutierrez explains, the American Red Cross is taking a major hit as well. A spokesperson for the American Red Cross says so far they've had to cancel 40 to 50 blood drives across our state, Georgia and South Carolina. We've lost approximately 1,100 units of blood and platelet products due to the hurricane. The American Red Cross expects more cancellations this week. Those units are things we're counting on to help meet our, our patient demands and their needs in the hospital. Right now, they need donations. Certainly how people can help during this time frame is in unimpacted areas is to find a blood drive near you, come out and donate. Donate to help replenish a blood supply that's running extremely low. It's a precious commodity that we need every day, those blood and platelet products to help save and sustain lives. To locate donation sites near you, you can head to redcross.org. In Winston-Salem, Kirsten Gutierrez, WXI 12 News.